Hello, my name is Brad Saren, and I'm the superintendent, and I am so grateful to have been extended an invitation to read a book for Black History Month for 2022 in honor of. And so the book that I have been invited to read is For You Are a Kenyan Child. Roosters crow and you wake one morning in the green hills of Africa, sun lemon bright over eucalyptus trees, full of doves. Odie, anyone home? Caribou, welcome. Enter mama's hut that smells of earth and smoke. On a small stool by her fire, sip maize porridge to begin the day. You are a Kenyan child. Take grandfather's cows to the pasture. My son, Mama says, watch them carefully. Into the wild morning wind, you herd the sleepy cows to the meadow where they graze. Then just for a moment, you slip away to see who else is awake. Bashir is opening the tea shop, red and yellow beanie on his long, loopy hair. He shakes your hand and you shake his, for this is hello for a Kenyan child. He lets you look at him cook. He asks, do you want a pancake? He gives you the first hot one of the day. But wait, what's that out the doorway? A great black monkey hurries by. Run from the shop to look, chase after it. You want to see, but the monkey leaps high to its home in the tops of the trees. You are not watching grandfather's cows on the hill, but you haven't been gone so long, have you? Odie, caribou, inside a little wood shop, you peek and you greet the village chief respectfully. Hello, respected one. Mzi was once an African warrior who hunted lion and carried a spear. He says, do you want to hold the chief stick? Yes, you cry, and march proudly around him, lifting it high. Grandfather's cows are waiting thirsty from their grassy breakfast. They want someone to take them to the stream for a drink. But look, who's putting tin dishes on her hedge to dry? Odie? Caribou? Grandmother, plump as a hen, smiles and asks, do you want sleeping milk sweetened with crushed charcoal, fresh from a gourd? As you drink, grandmother's, grandmother's knowing eyes remind you of something you should do. What could it be? Oh no, grandfather's cows. Tell grandmother you are very busy with your chores and hurry away to those cows. But whose garden of green onions is this? Who's hot under that noonday sun? Odie, caribou, Winnie, skinny with soft hair is laughing, baby brother tied in a cloth on her back. Do you want a bug? And from the sky, she offers you one because they are so sweet. Mmm, you say, for a Kenyan child. The two of you push gently with your toes, a dung beetle rolling dung from his home.
Odie, Caribou, Pick two, your friend, the same age as you, picks a rag ball by in the African dust. Do you want to play, he asks. Of course, you shout and run without thinking of anything else in the world you would have to do but kick the ball with your friend. While you catch your breath, look at the hillside. Where are grandfather's cows? Always graze. The cows, they're gone. Run to the meadow. You should not have left. Run as fast as you can. Bare feet over red road. Past women washing clothes. Skinny dogs barking. Run faster. The cows must be crashing someone's garden or standing in the road. Lost at the schoolhouse or gone over a cliff. Why did you wander? Why didn't you stay and do the job that your mom gave you today? Uh-oh, there's grandfather, where you should be on the path with his cows, going home for evening tea. Grandfather looks at you, and you look down, and then he says, let's go home now. And he puts your cow switch back in your hand. Take the cows home with grandfather. Do not stray. You are a Kenyan child and have been everywhere and seen everything in this African village today. Cows sleeping, rooster quiet, friends home too. Curl up in your little hut near mama and listen closely. You might hear among the tall trees a great black monkey telling her child the story of being chased by a boy until they fall asleep. Like you, like us. Thank you for taking the time to listen to the story for you are a Kenyan child. All my best and enjoy all the activities um, over th uh, this throughout this month. And thank you to our Department of Systemic Equity and Inclusion for all of the amazing organization that it's taken for the Sun Prairie Area School District to make sure that this event is honored uh, throughout all 15 of our schools and our partner sites in 4K. Take care.